Hey y'all, um, today is Thursday. I will try to get this uploaded later on, maybe tomorrow, but I got a, oh goodness, Timo package. So, I knew there was, there's at least, there's a few more coming. There's always Timu that is in processing, um, shipped, uh, in my cart, always in my cart. Um, I, I don't know if I'll ever have an empty cart. What about you guys? I just don't know if I can, if I can do it. Because that literally means that you have an empty cart and you don't go and look and see and do anything and they don't listen to you when you don't want them to listen to you and you're talking about something and pretty specific and then all of a sudden, well, oh, bam, everywhere you go, something like that item is all of a sudden for sale. Um, so bizarre, I, I just, being born in the 70s, but really being, I guess the 70s, I survived the 70s, um, an 80s child, how fast all this technology has gone, it, it's, it's, um, it's scary, and the older generations than myself have a very hard time with this, including, like, my dad, and these these um, companies that keep promoting AI, it just, I don't know. All this AI stuff just scares me. And I think there's just so much more of it coming. Okay, this is really weird. And I'll have to look at the timing, but last time there was a helicopter. And this time there's a helicopter. So there is someone, like I said, that lives around here that has a heliopad. Sorry, gosh, I can't help but to stop and kind of listen to it. And it sounds like he's on the same path. So it's either him, um, but also, oh Lord, I did, I, I did lay out. So anyway, um, so it's either him or there's a hospital. I don't know, probably five miles, maybe seven miles down the other way. And they also um, have a heliopad, so maybe that's what it is. I, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, I had a good 4th of July. It was pretty basic, simple. Um, nothing too crazy. And then I am excited, you guys. So this weekend, this Sunday, my family um for my mother-in-law's birthday she picked this train trip so we're all going to meet in chattanooga tennessee and there's a train that we take and i believe it's a total four hours so we do like a brunch and a dinner um and do this train through the mountains and just a nice air-conditioned fun train ride and I mean, I've done train rides but not so much scenic I've done one really pretty scenic one going from Seattle into Victoria um, Canada and that was amazing so I think this one's a little bit different because that one was a wine train and this one I don't think I think this is bring your own um, water and snacks kind of train but it's still gonna be a lot of fun and I'm excited because anytime my family and I we can get all of us together because everybody's so busy and living somewhere else and I mean I get that as much as I can and um, you will if you haven't noticed you will see more and more of what we do for family time so I'm gonna try to vlog some of that day I don't know how good I'll be at it because the family may be like darting me and whatnot. I don't know. Um, that's their choice, whatever. And then you may have some that just want to be on the camera the whole time. And you may have some that get away with getting the camera and going. Should be a lot of fun. So anyway, I hope that um, I can get that up and going. It'll be probably a day or two after because I'm sure I'll have to do editing. And then 
I should have more Timu stuff. So anyway, hopefully this will keep going, going and going. Um, let me stop right here and say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to my subscribers um, and my new subscribers. You guys rock. Like, what in the world? So, I'm glad you guys are liking my videos and that you're subscribing because you're just getting me. Uh, and I'm not trying to put a show on for anybody, um, which is, I am trying to put a show on for you. Actually, I'm trying to do stuff that you guys would enjoy watching. And I know one of you uh, commented that you want me to do a Walmart haul. I would like to do a Walmart haul as well. There's not a Walmart super close. I mean, there is one kind of close um, with the traffic here where we live. It, it, it's not really close but i do get to walmart so i will do that um i'm sorry i haven't done that yet I just kind of started following. please don't follow okay um also i used the fan that i got and that's on my thumbnail and it was amazing and i meant to have it to show you guys but it was in the last i think it was in the last haul or the haul before that and it's the black and orange one and it has three settings so I let it charge all night and today took it out with me and put it on the highest setting and I mean it works great it it's still hot but it's blowing hot air um, but it does have a good bit of strength it's still on and that's probably why I forgot to grab it because I want to see how long it'll go for and then it has the bright light in the middle which has the three also the three um, strengths so it's pretty cool. I think it would be great for camping in the horse riding competition years that we used to do um, with trailers or, or at night. It would have been really nice to have something like that. We used to make the redneck air conditioners. That's what we call them. Don't anybody take offense because you're looking at a redneck. I mean, hello. Um, so we used to get the igloo coolers and buy a fan cut the top out so you stick the fan where it blows out right and you make it a, a cord where it goes out the side you even do like a little releasing and you fill it with ice and then you can pack your drinks and whatever but when you plug it in it blows cool air from the ice now it does make your eyes go faster but that's okay when it's 90 something degrees and you're at an equestrian event <laughs> you do not care you want air so but nowadays those don't even need to really exist so they were just kind of funny okay um i think that's it for gabbing right now i don't know what's in here and i know everybody says that every time and i'm sorry um but i really i really don't know so let's just get into it shall we I'm still trying to figure out where it'll look. I know when I look here, I'm looking in the middle of the screen and it looks weird to me. But if I look over here, that feels right because you're taught to look. So, I feel like my eyes go all over the place. Let's see. Oh yeah, I'm also wearing one of the two pieces that I got. Oh my goodness. Come on now. Come on, man. Um which is also in, let's pull that up a little bit, also in the thumbnail, and it is one of the bandeau ones. Um, and I love it. Like, I really, really like it. I could possibly actually wear this one um, in some type of public setting. I don't know. Your girl's gonna be 50, like in a matter of a couple months. So, but I don't want to be 50. Like, I don't mind being 50. That's all good. Um, but I don't want to, like, snap a finger and turn into a grandma. Um, I don't think 50 is a grandma. Uh, even if you are a grandmother, I have a married daughter, and I cannot wait for some grandbabies. I can wait, but I can't wait. Um, so I'm not saying it from an age perspective. I just don't want to start looking frumpy. And I don't really know what's proper and what's not. So I'm kind of just riding that line. So anyway. Okay. 
Go figure. Always. False nails. So there's something called a nail trend going on where you just pick a bunch of nails from like a group that you had. So this was, I think, a whole like setting of something. And I was like, I'll do that for a hot minute and then I'll change them. But yep, nails. It's like I can't help myself. There's something wrong. Um, I have lots of nails. But now I'm starting to learn more and more like the length I like for whatever I'm doing. Um, what's more suitable for my life. This is... It says, you guys, it says small mush extra XMG. I don't know. Let's just pull it out. Oh, they don't feel good. Oh, okay. I can't show these. I'm glad I took these down here. Um, okay. This is underwear for Matt, but I can't show the front. Um, so, um, because of the picture of a mushroom in the middle. That's all I need to say. So, yeah. Okay, that's kind of funny. I'm kind of like, that's, that's funny to me. Um, yeah. Okay, where are we on here? these are clothing so one of the hauls I did I had a pink um, tank top on and it has a built-in I think that one did a built-in bra yeah so I in I am in love with it so I ordered more and it came in that color oh look this one's open got a black one This is like, let's see what it looks like on camera. Oh, it looks like baby doo doo. It's not, it's like an olive green color. So not even, you guys, it is not even in the same dead gum, like Pantone area as the color it is that you're seeing. That's crazy. Well, this is pink. Let's see what it looks like to you. It could be orange. Hold on, what's that? Oh, it looks like it's pink to you. Now, this one is a lighter pink than the one I have, so that is awesome. One, two, three, so, and then this one. I just want to get it out of its smelly existence. I let it breathe. I mean, it. Guys, this heat, now I will say though, yesterday day four it was beautiful um the breeze which there's a little breeze going on right now but it was in like the low 80s and there was no humidity and i was like oh this this is this is what i want but living in georgia it literally can change the weather can change in like and we just all of a sudden you're pouring down rain and just really bad weather or during the winter it may be 80 degrees and then it may be 45 and then it may snow or it may not or it might we don't know we'll just let you know when we know which they never seem to know very well how to predict that which i mean it's weather i'm sure it's really hard to predict what it's gonna do and get it right um, okay, so these seem kind of weird to me. Let's see. They still did it that way, and I am not sure why. So, last week when I got, last week, yeah, it was last week, when I got the tabs that I hauled, these are for them. And I didn't know, maybe they had already come in. I don't know. There's so much stuff that comes in. I just can't even remember. Um, so, no wonder I've just kept them out until I can find these. There they are. I 
huskies want to come out so bad, you guys. But it is, it's hot. And then they come out. Now, on my porch, it's not that bad because we have a constant wind. But, I mean, you guys know, it still gets hot up here. You see me sweating it. Um, and then why don't I film inside? Um, no specific reason, really. Just like to come outside and like to spend time when I can with you guys doing this stuff um and not let it sit like I did that last haul because it was ridiculous and it's a process I mean, you, you order all this stuff you gotta put it all away but you think ah well you ordered it so you needed it so you have a place for it so next is I don't know. The flags or whatever the porch um flags that I ordered, we put them on and they were perfect. Uh, absolutely perfect. I paid $17, a little over $17 for those. I got three packs of the four, which did my, like I said, in between each banister all the way across my porch. Um, you cannot compare that. Now, if you want the six foot ones and they're like a little, I guess, heftier in material, you're going to pay more. That, all the power to you can be very ostentatious um, when you already have a porch that's kind of, that is large anyway. So we're not really trying to be like, hey, here we are, happy fourth. We're just more like, we're celebrating the day. Thank you to all of our veterans and our independents and that stuff. Not to be like, stop, wait a minute, check out the house. No, no, no. The deer already do plenty of that right there in the yard beside us. Every night I'm just sitting there saying my prayers that, um, that one doesn't get hit because there's a lot of them and they're not very smart. Okay. I, I don't remember. I always would order double, which is fine because I'll put these away. It's just a 24 karat gold eye treatment mask. Um, I already have some that I just opened. And it's the ones that go under the eyes again. And like I said, you try to keep them on. I just try to forget that they're on there until they're kind of dry. But there are also times where I have 15 minutes where I could sit and have those on there or try to do something else and get 15 minutes. But I told you guys before, I don't, I've not found one that's better than the other. So I try different ones each time and I'm still getting good results or, I mean, other than going in for some kind of like filler or Botox, which don't get me wrong, I do like Botox. Don't have it right now, but I do like it. Um, yeah. Try it. They're not, they're not much. Yeah, there's, I don't know, it's some weird stuff in the bottom of this. Oh, right. This is hair shorts for my husband. Yep. Yeah. So they're just like some army green. They look khaki. They straight up look khaki to you guys, but they're not. They're, once again, it's like an olive green. Um, has zipper on both sides which is good. Um, also has pockets and there are no back pockets, which is fine. So those are good. Try to get him to wear like lighter weight shorts because he does wear shorts all the time, especially for work. So it's not that I tried to get him. He actually need, needs more of those. The mystery. I don't know. 
So, is this one of my free items? Hmm. Um. I don't know what it is yet, but look at that. Look at that. Talk about some crazy bad soldering welding uh, wow okay now let's see what it is I'm already okay yeah so it's um it's to grab your wheat it's not quite like a hoe because it has the fork pins on it which are sharp um and i'm sure that's probably yeah that's got a little serrated to it too so you just go around pluck them out um get them by the roots so they don't grow back this is i mean there's stuff right look at my hands you guys look at what's doing in my hands All right. I would wear gloves anyway because I would be let's pull this chair up some. I would be gardening. But hmm. Yuck. Okay. This is for my iPhone. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, yeah, cool. I like that. So just a little pink. Have enameled butterfly and it's got the little rhinestone accents going down it very pretty silver I think if I put it in my iPhone it might not fit right because I have um, a case on there but let's try <laughs> there we go Oh, that was not going to work. Yeah, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. There we go. It's cute. Cute, cute, cute. Okay. So, oh. this is an interesting bag because there's some boxes in here. I think some of, I think my freebie stuff has been, I think that's what's happening. This is not a freebie. This is, it looks like a, what do you think this is? oh yeah, it's a robe. Just kind of a satin, almost it is definitely like an oriental robe but i love the colors i just want something more flowy with it being so hot right now the robe i have robes i have are very um winter wearable so i can't put them on after i shower and then run around or start getting ready because i just start sweating from the shower so that one is more lightweight. That is good. Just good. I feel like that's what well, it is good. It's good. And now this. Let's do this. There. Okay, I think this is another possible pair of underwear. <laughs> okay well this okay so i'm not gonna have to show you the front because how cool are these pickles you guys with the sunglasses yeah just for some underwear and then the front in the middle is just a really big pickle with sunglasses that's it Oh goodness. <laughs> will he wear them? Uh, he will try them on. But will he wear them? <laughs> I don't really care. I 
Like, I have some fun. I have some fun. What are these things? What in the world is that? What what did I buy? Looks like some looks like it's made for a hamster. Or Transparent green. Yep, it is. It's definitely that. All right. <laughs> Plastic. Together. Plastic. And a cloth wick. So, I'm not real, obviously, there's no obviously, I don't know what the heck that is, but if there's not at least one thing in every shipment that I don't have to go back to see what it is, what fun would a team new shipment be? Bring on the hauls with the, I don't know, oh yeah, I like it, I almost said that's what somebody needs. The most said sayings about Team I mean, I'm not going to watch it, but somebody would. Okay, let's do this. So, I was just saying about talking about Botox. And I've had Botox a couple times. Um, but when I broke my ankle, I haven't had it in going on about a year. And you can tell because I've got these, which are not that bad because I actually use a Botox cream, which has helped. Um, but I was trying to try these and see. And it's forehead wrinkle patches. Not looking to do one of these a day. Um, a matter of fact, it says... Wow, it says to leave on for 90 minutes. So, yeah, so maybe once a week. That's a long time. That's a long time. I've never. Is that right? Where are my glasses? Hold on, guys. Hold on. Sixty to ninety minutes. Dang God. That's 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 a long time. Anyway, I got two of them, but those you can't be in any hurry. You're gonna have to sit down, find your favorite subscriptions on YouTube, and go to town for an hour or whatever you watch. You're obviously watching some YouTube. Are you? me watching so I dropped something yeah perfect thank you guys it's kind of rude to be like la, 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 a dip and dash so so this is for the side of my bed so maybe my nightstand will finally look like a nightstand and not have a billion things on it like my books and scheduling everything so just the inside and it's just one open pouch um, and then it folds onto your bed and this goes in the bottom and it actually does drop quite nicely I know it's hard to tell um, it's got a pocket on this side two little hooks on that side um, two front pockets so they're just helpful and they like I said they fit down at the bottom part so you're not gonna hit it or it's not gonna trip you up you're not even really gonna know it's there except when you're using it so that's good just trying to clean my area up a little bit more organizing very slowly very slowly um, I don't remember ordering this. 
but I will try it. Let's see what they'll. Oh, maybe. So this is Varoni Enhanced Hairline Powder. I don't really even know what that means. So does that mean like like this? Is it to make me look like I have more hair? Because I don't need to look like I have more hair. Or is it to like cover up gray? Goodness. The model goes from like... Ah, oh, it's weird. Look. <laughs> you know what it makes me think of? The, and they still have them, I think like in Cracker Barrels and different places, but the, not the Etch-A-Sketch, but the one where it's got the man's face. And then it started, they started doing like a woman's face or I don't remember, different animals. And you would take the magnetic pen and it would have all the magnets at the bottom and you would take it and you would draw it up and you couldn't let it go or all the magnets would fall. So, and you've got it flat. So you take it and you just start doing hair on them and like mustache and just before all this technology, but they do still have them. And you better believe when my kids were growing up, they got those things. They had a slinky. They had, they had um, a Rubik's cube. They got all the stuff I had. I was like, you can not get hooked on all this electronic stuff. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? All right. I don't know. So it's got kitty cats on it, so that leads me to believe it's going to be for my daughter. Feels like a smock. Oh no, the nightgown. <laughs> so I will wash this and give it to her. It's a night, like a little nightgown with kitty cats all over it. She's a little bit obsessed, not really. She loves her cats, and I mean, she is an animal lover, so that's to be expected. So, I think it's cute. All right, this is green, and it is. Now, I wanna see what this green looks like on camera. And now the lighting's kinda of changing a little bit, too. Ooh, I don't know. Okay, let's see what you get. So I kind of get like a dusty green. It's not, it's a little different. It's still a little different. I'm glad I know that. I'm sure, now I'm sure with a much better camera and setup and lighting that it would be the correct colors. I'm a baby YouTuber. Like, yeah, an itty bitty baby YouTuber. So, If I grow and continue or continue to grow and you guys can help me out with the different things that I need that um, won't cost me a fortune, I'm all for it. But I like what I do right now. So I'm just gonna keep this up for right now and uh, we'll just see what we do. So I remember it's for earrings. How many of us have ordered so many dead gum earrings from Timu. They're everywhere. You guys, you saw I got that plastic container the other day to put earrings in. It's just insane. So they're just basically page after page after page. It's got in the very back. I don't know. There you go. I have no idea. It's just a soft place for the earrings to hit. Right here, it does have a pouch. And then it closes up. It's cute. Stitching is nice. Um, the snap closure, super easy. Uh, the, the material is thin. I mean, it's definitely thin. But to just store earrings in, or even travel with them. Um, yeah, I know it's nice. I like too how 
they give you the option, you know, you could do a pierced or you could do, not pierced, you could do the ones with post or you could do um, hoops or the ones that hook on. Get my brain wrapped around it at some point. By the time we're done with this, I'll, I'll have it all figured out. All gonna be figured out. Okay. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Okay. What is this? If you aren't broken, you might be now. Yeah. Well, this is definitely, oh, what was made in the racket in there. Okay, I got two of these. Speaking of earrings and jewelry and whatnot, I'm not sure which way this goes. Hold on, I'll show you guys. Um, probably... So it's also a jewelry organizer. It can sit, but it's meant to hang on your wall or um, it's just meant to hang on the back of something else. And then, let me just hold on a second. There's all kinds of stuff that comes with it. There's like the hinges that I'll have to put on. No big deal. Um, okay. Open up your so, this is what the inside looks like. Once again, lots of places for earrings, lots of places for necklaces. Then, this will swing open. I guess you can do like more stud earrings or just more earrings in general on both sides. I'm assuming this side does it too. Let's see. Yeah, so they both do it. So then you have even more. I don't know, it's really cool. I definitely like this very much. So it's just regular plastic. I got it in the pink that they consider, I mean, it is pink. It's kind of like a see-through rose. Um, and like I said, I got two of these. So I was going to put one in my master closet. Um, and then one upstairs where I have a lot of the Timu jewelry and other type of jewelry that I've gotten. To just make it look nicer and more organized instead of running up there like a maniac when I'm trying to get ready for something. And this other one is stuck too. Sorry. And I know what I'm looking for, but I don't know where it is. And I'm running all over the place looking for it. And then I end up not finding it. I'm wearing something else, and that's just the way it goes. Okay. Four piece set. The sun went behind the clouds. It's giving me a little bit of comfort. Ooh, it's hot. It is hot. Oh, these are okay. And, um, they're very colorful. Okay, so they hang. They have a little hanger on the back. And they're, they're just metal, like a tin. And then they're painted. And you have the pink, an orange, a yellow, and blue. They're a little bit more vibrant than what they're coming up on the camera. Um, purple and the blue. And then... A red with kind of a little bit of all of it. Other than the blue. Um, these are really pretty. And I don't know where I was thinking about using these. I don't know. So maybe upstairs. They definitely, they don't match. They don't match anything downstairs. So it might be cute upstairs in one of the spare rooms. Or somewhere else. I have no idea. You guys, as you, you know, 
some of these things I'm like, I just don't even know. And they still end up gone because somebody wants something. Oh, yep. And I should have, hopefully, let's see, three of these. Okay. So. My makeup, well, right now, my makeup is too much, too much. Um, but my makeup in my bathroom that's in its little different apartments and whatnot. Oh, that one's cracked. There you go, guys. Now I could butt that one up against like the wall. But what they do is they go, they, you can put them anywhere. So that sticks to wherever you want them. And then it hangs. And then you can just fill it. And there is a little bow, which I wasn't going to put the little bow on it. But there it is. I don't know where it goes. Somewhere on there. Um, oh, well. So, there is. Let's see. These are okay. Yeah. And if they're not, I mean... You can do a return. You have 90 days to do a return with Timu. Um, they're going to ask me to ship it back. And I'm, I have no desire to go through the gas and process of shipping it back for when I paid less than a dollar for it. Um, now, if they all three were like that and bad, I would probably do it more to make a statement or a point. But... Nah. Okay, let's see what else we got. There's something in the... I don't know what that is, but hey, how you doing? So when I got this bag, or found this bag on my porch, the bottom was just soaking wet. And even when I brought it in, it was like dripping, soaking wet. And a little... <clears throat> Just, just deterred by it. So good. Um, but whatever. It's all good. I don't know what this is. 0.23 pound colorful mini rocks. I mean, isn't there like gum that they make that's like this? Then it all turns into like one big piece. Or it looks like the bottom of an aquarium, right? Okay. All right, this is the last thing. I hope it's not a bunch of um, little pebbles little pebbles my brain you can tell I'm sorry I need to just stop thinking and just keep going I just I really have no clue I mean I would have had to look that up and like be looking for that or something similar to that okay let's see what we got here I don't know if I could show this either. Another pair of underwear. Of course, we're going to finish with my husband's underwear. What in the... Oh, my. Yeah. An elephant. See the elephant? It's all the elephant. Yeah. It's an elephant. It's doing his thing. Just hanging around. Not too excited about much. Just hot out there in the elephant world. <laughs> you guys are awesome. I really, really, really appreciate you staying till the end if you did. Um, I don't know if I already said, please subscribe. I get a lot of views that don't have a lot of subscriptions, which is, I'm not gonna fit 
everybody's whatever and I'm not trying to um, so if you like it and you want to see more of what I've got going on and it's not always gonna be hauls like I said it's gonna be some life some life that happens to this family oh my and um, I don't know what else who knows with this journey but I so appreciate it um, notifications if you want to make sure that when I do post something you know about it um, and like I said just like 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 because I hit some kind of algorithm the other day and well that was pretty cool so don't know much about that once again at this point I want to know some about it but not huge amounts I'm just not um, Gotta leave a little bit of space. This is a, this is a step by step process as I'm learning. So you guys, thanks so much for hanging in there with me. Bye, y'all.